Kardashian excludes her family on her list of favorite people. Plus, Kim celebrates National Nude Day like only she can. Hey guys, it's Emily for HollywoodLife.com, and Kim is apparently celebrating National Nude Day going reverse commando, wearing a camo jacket over a very revealing mesh dress fashion goals? Speaking of nudity, Kim was also just snapped singing along with Kanye's famous, I thought this was Kylie's move. Switching gears, remember MySpace? I wonder what ever happened to Tom. Anyway, Kim recently took to her website to reveal who her former top eight friends were on MySpace. For you youngins out there, the MySpace top eight section was basically a list of who was in your squad. Kim's top eight back then is pretty amazing, with number one being Courtney, then Rob, and then somehow Brody Jenner makes it. Wow, the times have changed. And then, of course, Ray J. Amazing, but all right, Kim also let everyone know who she would put on her current list. Kanye West makes it at number one, of course. Jonathan Chebin is number three, even after he ditched Kim for a lookalike version. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. well, hello. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too, finally. <sighs> Jonathan's trying to rub this in my face and make me feel some type of way, but I don't. I mean, Jonathan can try all he wants to go and replace me, but he can't. Go try, honey. Go try. But all right, the rest of her top eight doesn't include any Kardashian or Jenner family members, not even Kylie. Wait, was Kylie even born when MySpace was big? I gotta Google that after this. All right, guys, I need to hear from you. What Kardashian makes your top eight? Thank you guys for watching. We love you all so much, and all we ask so that we can keep making these awesome videos is that you subscribe to our channel, which is so easy. All you have to do is click on me on your desktop or down here below on your mobile device, subscribe, and that's it. See, so simple. All right, begging session over. Bye, guys.